you are? Max. 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 My name's Lenny Meyer. And you are? Max. Max. Max Cohen. Cohen? Jewish. <laughs> That's okay. I'm a Jew too. Do you practice? No. I'm not interested in religion. Have you ever heard of Kabbalah, no. Jewish mysticism. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm very busy. I understand. So what do you do? I work with computers, maths, number theory, um, research mainly. Number theory? No way. <laughs> I work in theory too. Not not traditional though. No, I work with the Torah. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. You know, Hebrew is all numbers. It's all math. Hmm? The ancient Jews. They used Hebrew as their numerical system. Each letter is a number. <clears throat> the Hebrew A, one. B, bet, is two. <laughs> you can turn any Hebrew text into a long string of numbers. The Torah is just a long string of numbers. Some say it's a long code sent to us from God. Kind of interesting. Yeah. Take the Hebrew word for the Garden of Eden, Kadem. Kuf, Dalai, Mem. Kuf, 100, Dalai, 4, Mem, 40, equals 100, and 44. Then, take the Hebrew word for the tree of knowledge in the garden. Atchahem equals 233. But when you divide two... The Fibonacci numbers. Huh? Fibonacci sequence, um, Italian mathematician, 13th century. If you divide 144 into 233, approaches theta. Theta. The Greek symbol for the golden ratio, the golden spiral. You're right. I never saw that before. That's the series that occurs in nature. Like the face of a sunflower. Wherever there's spirals.
see. There's maths everywhere. Everywhere. 